Hi, everybody. Wanted to give you just a quick uh, recording to show you how you're going to access Google Classroom. I'm um, getting a lot of questions from parents, so we wanted to just be clear about that simple step to get us started with Google. So as you can see here, I'm on just a regular browser. Uh, I'm going to go to google.com very simply, and I'm going to check over here. Now, notice I'm not signed in. You may be signed in with a personal Google account. What you want to do is you want to make sure you sign out of that. And then when you click sign in, you're going to use your gateway sign in information. Now mine is stored here, so I'm just going to click on this. But for those of you, um, for students, you want to make sure that the students sign in with their gateway email as their username. And then their password is their student ID number. Now, if you don't have this information, it is on Skyward. Uh, you can go in and find your student's email address. And it's usually um, three letters, three numbers at gatewayk12.net. It's really important that you sign in with the student's information. It should look like this, Gateway School District in a blue screen. This is our single sign-in. This makes sure that you have proper access to all of our tools. Click sign in and you're ready to go. Now it just looks like a normal Google screen, but we're signed in. Uh, I have my little, uh, my gator there, you can see that. And you wanna check to make sure your student's icon is there. And all you do is click on classroom right there. And of course we've got all the other products that can, they have access to. They can check their email, they can access their Google Drive, but Classroom, we'll just click onto that. And right on this main screen, you should start seeing your teacher's classrooms. If you have any questions, please reach out. I'm here to help. We're all going to get through this. And um, if you have any questions, just let me know. Thank you so much. And we will see you next time.